you've probably seen us using these radios. Now, this is the Kuncheng UVK5, and uh, we've been sent another one to try. So we've uh, modded the firmware, and uh, we're going to do a bit of a distance check. Um, we're on foot. We're about maybe two miles, and it's just quite a thick area as well. So, about two miles uh, from another UVK5 user with the same mod. So we'll do a little radio check now and uh, see if they can hear us. About two miles, we're low to ground. There's a lot of stuff in between us. So here we go. Uh, radio check, radio check, WIM 1, WIM 2. Can you hear me? To Flappy Spot is responding. WIM 1 to Flappy Spot. Uh, you can hear me really good, yeah? Any crackling or is it all, all good? Uh, I am actually by some electrical pylons, which might affect it, but uh, can you hear me okay? Okay, I'm going to walk on, we're going to do another mile or two and see what happens. Um, okay, speak to him out. So yeah, this is a great radio, it does um, airband. Um, it actually goes from about, I think about 18 megahertz up to about 1.3 gigahertz. Cover CB radio. Um, AM as well as good AM filter, which is uh, really useful, and uh, packs out at about five watts. So it's pretty good. It's got USB-C charge, um, and the battery. Once you charge it, lasts quite a long time. The thing is, I'm running down to. 27% 27% battery so we'll see what happens so we've also got this cool feature of a spectrum analyzer so you can analyze um, frequencies and find um, any signals you want to listen to which is always quite good but this uh, old technology is definitely getting a boost it's been modernized um, it's quick and easy you can do all sorts of mods on your um, PC on it you know so anyone out there is into CB radio or anything like that uh, you should definitely definitely get your hands on one of these definitely not line of sight this hills in the way uh, electrical pylons trees but I can hear you like um, almost like clear digital signal I am uh, past the church. Okay. I'll head back that way now. All right, I'll meet you. Okay. Yeah, guys. So if you're out hiking, uh, particularly you know as a group or a pair of people, um, uh, or if you're meeting somebody somewhere, these are great. You know, uh, chuck them in your bag. Um, you can leave them turned on for days, um, the battery lasts, so uh, these, these are great, you know, when you're out and about, and if you ever get into trouble, um, you know, there's so many frequencies on there, you can always find somebody to shout at, um, you know, if you, if you get into trouble, there's other safety features and stuff as well, it's got like um, an emergency alarm on it, it's sort of like, it's really loud, um, when people get close to you, but I definitely advise getting one of these. Anyone hiking, going out and about, or, um, yeah, grab one. And um, yeah, see you out there then. Okay, uh, Wim 1, Wim 2, can you hear me now? I can hear you. Is it all loud and clear? Uh, any crackling?
Brilliant, so we've travelled probably like quite a few miles now. Um, so it's good, we're going to maybe go a bit further. Maybe not, we might have to take the vehicle out and try it from there. But, uh, okay, I'll speak to you in a sec. Okay.